Yo, what's up guys? It's Pi Eagles here, the Crypto Pi. And today we're going to be talking about Bitcoin because Bitcoin will indicate what the market is doing, guys. I'm well aware it's Friday. However, just no crypto market roundup because the market's just not bullish at all, right? Uh, when the market will be bullish again, I can do crypto market roundups again. But at the moment, guys, there's just not much to say. Um, it will be all very, very bearish and not nothing much going on. So it will not help any of you guys, really. Um, that's why we just have another regular update on Bitcoin. So um, we obviously had Bitcoin going bullish, right? Uh, especially on the 50 minute, it was very, very easy to spot. Uh, you know, we counted our five ways down, which was our one, two, three, four, and then five, you know, ending in this five. And well, after that, well, you know, it, it, this was not really easy to count or anything, right? What is this? One, two, three, four, five. Are we done then already? Like, uh, we just don't know, right? Um, it, it's all very, very ugly. But what you could have done is at least looked on the 15 minute and you could see some bullish crossing here and entered your position, right? Very easy trade. Um, but at the moment, you do have to realize that we are cross bearish and that's just not good, right? It's just not good to see. You can see some massive uh, selling here. This is on the 50 minutes. We're gonna zoom out a little further. On the 30 minute here, we obviously had this bullish crossing here. Then we went up, um, but you know, nonetheless, the same thing. Uh, you might also immediately spot this, you know, some kind of head and shoulder meme here. Uh, so definitely, it showed you that it's not all that strong. And what, what I said as well in the video was, uh, you know, it's just a bounce, guys. Don't expect more than a bounce. And that's what we've got, right? We had a bounce. Well, that bounce certainly made me some money, but not a whole lot either, guys. <laughs> you know, it's just not a whole lot going on, right? So right now, uh, you know, I, I cannot really count this um may, you know it's very hard if, if if this is countable at all right is this your one two or is this your one two right you know uh i just really don't know so i'm just patiently waiting right you need to be patiently waiting for it to find a bottom uh you cannot just be rushing in and taking a trade okay so that is what i see going on at the moment on bitcoin uh, this I think is a temporary bottom we might even go even lower so uh, guys just keep that in mind right that this could be a temporary bottom we can definitely go lower so let me just uh, buy so I, I took the Fibonacci right from this bottom uh, to this top because well this bottom was you know lower but that doesn't matter um, 618 is holding for now but if this falls guys um, then expect a double bottom and maybe even lower okay because if we zoom out on the daily here you can see we're still in this area right but the low of this area um, is at 2955 so about 3k $3,000 right that's way lower than where we are right now that's $900 lower that is um, let's see here that's about 24% lower okay uh, so just keep that in mind guys don't flip out I want you guys to just stay calm and uh, yeah all right and this also lines up with uh, this top here obviously right so it's a lot of confluence and I don't like this candle at all that is forming right now on the daily because it is it's very red right um, it's just not looking nice okay uh, this is not one candle that I say is a consolidation or anything or a, a small pullback this is a big pullback okay so we need to hold here if the six five breaks I do expect a double bottom um, and then uh, you know maybe we'll get another bounce but maybe we'll also just simply um, go further down so just wait patiently to see what happens uh, if we can hold this just react to the market instead of trying to predict it okay guys uh, that is pretty much all I have to say today is that we need to react to the market and not predict it uh, because it's very hard to predict at the moment it's just not following anything uh, that 
it's not any following anything nicely, right? Uh, but it is definitely following the support and resistance. That's why we had some bounce here, right? Um, and this was based on these lows. Uh, these lows are at 35, 3600, right? Uh, but this low right here is at three thousand dollars at 29.55. So um, we could definitely get down there, guys. All right, just keep that in mind, and that would also, you know, be this high on this one. So. And if you go even lower, then you could get to 1800. So guys, just be patiently waiting, right? Our time will come that the bullish market is back, but right now is not that time. So just be patiently waiting. And if you want to take a trade, then it needs to be in the trade of the trend direction, which is a short, right? Um, so, you know, it's definitely hard to say, right? Because shorting, um, well, <laughs> uh, I mean, yeah, you, you could, but like I said, guys, on BitMEX, if you are on a different platform than BitMEX, go ahead. But on BitMEX, your stops don't will not always go through because, well, they will go through, but they will sometimes just go through at a different level than you set them because of the massive, uh, I don't know, it's like server outage or whatever. So it, it's not something I like doing that much. Right, uh, I do have a little bit on Bitmax, but not a whole lot, guys. Um, not anymore, because it's just it's dangerous. All right, so just keep that in mind. But uh, yeah, that that's that's for Bitcoin right now, guys. Uh, it's looking bearish right now. So back to bears, guys. Bears took over again. Uh, you know the short-term bounce was nice, and now we are back into a bearish trend once again on both the long term and the short term so that is kind of how it is right on the very long term however guys we are still bullish uh but that is uh hey <laughs> that, that could fall all the way to 1800 guys so hey you know as long as we keep the uh yeah as long as we don't go lower than this uh you know, we, we need to stay bullish in the very long term. But in the long term and the sh and the short term, we are back bearish. So just keep that in mind, guys. Um, either be in Tether or in US dollar or, you know. Um, I just don't want you guys to keep losing and losing and losing. I'm the, I definitely lost a lot as well. And, you know, in, in the last year, it's normal, guys, right? Uh, a lot of people lost a lot of money. And that's, that's just how it goes, right? So just keep your chin up and uh, we'll, we'll get through this together, right? Uh, it's not, you know, people who say the market's going to zero in, in my comments, no, uh, I don't believe so. Uh, I want you guys, whoever says that, to look at markets like Microsoft, Amazon, I don't care what instrument it is or company, uh, all you need to do is look at a chart, okay? Because all this shows you is that there's buying and there's selling, all right? Nothing more. It doesn't matter what it is, guys. It will go back up, all right? So, um, it, unless it's like some, some Ponzi, but Bitcoin is not a Ponzi, guys, right? Keep that in mind. Bitcoin is not a Ponzi, all right? It's just a cryptocurrency that we want to hold for a store of value, and some people want to use it to buy things as well, all right? So, just keep that in mind. Um, and that's that, guys, all right? Also, join, um, look, at my patreon page guys which is at patreon.com slash pygos check it out check which tier fits you and check if you want to become a patreon yourself um you can check it out um and yeah uh, claim your benefits through either telegram or discord just send me a pm there or of course send me a pm on patreon.com itself and yeah just claim it there also guys join up with the crypto price block where you can ask me any questions ask other people questions and it's just a great chat box to be in right let's see what's going on here uh we don't have much so uh you're talking about altcoins here well it, you know terry if bitcoin keeps dropping then i don't think this will be you know very short term maybe it may be a quick bounce to 424 maybe a little higher but after that boom further down okay so just keep that in mind um unless it shows you a bullish uh, trend then you can react to it but right now you just simply cannot all right so keep that in mind all right uh, i mean if you want to do it then go ahead but definitely have a stop all right so just keep yourself uh protected all right 
So also guys, join up with the CryptoPies feed where I post all my videos, post about upcoming ICOs. At the moment, don't expect any ICOs though guys, because the market is just simply very bearish. And uh, well, you would simply lose, all right? That's the short answer for that. Uh, it's that simple. Also guys, follow me on Twitter, which is twitter.com slash pygos. And follow me on Twitch, which is twitch.tv slash pygos. Both telegrams will be in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Hit that post notification button. And if you've got any questions at all, leave a comment below. And I'll see you guys in the next video.